Harold, talking about big fights need to be made. Everybody wants that big payday, but the fans want to see a good fight, first and foremost. And you know what? The fans are going to see that. Oh, yeah. You know, when you see uh, a, a great fight like Paul Williams and Sergio Martinez won, you know that Paul Williams, Sergio Martinez, too, has to be a great fight. I mean, you got a big guy like Williams who can box. Uh, you got a guy like Sergio Martinez who can punch. He's tricky. Southpaw, he circles. I, I mean, you know, he hits you with that big left over the top. Very, very tough guy to fight. Uh, he's quick. He's tricky. He's experienced good defense, so we know it's going to be a great fight. It was a great fight the first time, you know, possibly the fight of the year. I, I mean, I, I'm really expecting another bond burner this time, November the 20th in Atlantic City. That last fight, scoring-wise, it's hard. I mean, we all rely on your scores at times. That was a hard fight to score. Well, I had it the same way as Lynn Carter, one of the judges who had Paul Williams by two points, very, very close. I thought he pulled it out at the end. Uh, my daughter Julie was one of the judges, she had it a draw, and I think the other judge had Paul Williams by one point. So it was very, very close. Anyway, you looked at it, uh, I mean, you know, you really had to concentrate on each and every round like I always do, and, you know, come up with a winner. And, uh, you know, that's, it's going to be the same thing this time. I mean, I'm sure it's going to be darn close. Uh, Paul Williams could win it with his boxing, Sergio Martinez could win it with his big shots, you never know. Sergio looks a lot better. I mean, now he's got all that experience with, you know, the Williams one fight, the Kelly Pavlik fight, which he looked great in. So uh, I expect Sergio to put on a lot more pressure, do a lot more punching, make it a lot closer. Talking about a guy to put the fight grit, this guy goes Centron, Williams, Pavlik, now Williams again. This guy's not taking a break, and this is what great boxers do. Right. Sergio, I mean, about 35 years old. He fights everybody they put in front of him. you got to give him credit for that. You have to admire him. And not only that, he gives the fans a great fight. So, you know, uh, let's put it this way. He's well worth the money. <laughs>